Hello and welcome to Research That Matters, where we talk about what the latest science and research says about topics that matter to you. I'm Dr. Chris Freitag with Lavaca County Chiropractic in Hallettsville, Texas. And today we are talking about why does my neck hurt? <music> Your neck has a tough job. It has to hold, stabilize, and move the weight of your head every day for a lifetime. Holding up 11 pounds may not seem like a lot, but the seven bones and 20 muscles of your neck have to work together in perfect harmony to balance that weight so you move your head around free of pain. Postural changes, sudden injuries, and arthritis are just a few of the primary causes of neck pain. And that pain can often be traced to a problem with either the muscles, bones, discs, or nerves in your neck. If you've ever wondered, why does my neck hurt, and been able to turn, unable to turn your head for a day or two, you know how life-changing neck pain can be. The sharp muscle spasms that restrict your ability to move often happen when your body is trying to protect a spinal joint that isn't moving correctly. Almost every vertebrae in your neck has a pair of sliding joints towards the back called facet joints. If those joints become stuck, your body will try to adapt and compensate. But over time, that compensation can cause a cascade of additional challenges. Here's a summary of what you need to know. Sudden injuries, arthritis, and postural issues can all contribute to neck pain. The small gliding joints of the neck can become stuck, leading to muscle spasms and pain. Gentle spinal adjustments combined with a daily stretching can help restore proper motion in the joints of the neck and reduce pain. Pain in your neck is your body's way of saying pay attention. Even if your neck pain often eases up by the end of the day, it's a smart idea to have our team evaluate how it's moving. Movement assessments provide us with an incredible amount of information about your body. By taking a proactive approach to your health today, you may be able to prevent future episodes of neck pain and stiffness. It all starts with a call. Our doors are open and we are here to help. Thank you for joining me today for your latest episode of Research That Matters. Click the like or the share or the follow button right now to make sure that you, one, continue to receive the latest updates from the research that matters and that you pass this information on to someone in your life that may be struggling and dealing with neck pain and it may be affecting their quality of life needlessly. Thank you. Have a wonderful day.